Today we have foster care awareness, uh, the resolution for foster care awareness month in Pennsylvania, House Resolution 335. We are extremely excited to welcome our guests from the city of brotherly love. Um, they are here today in the Capitol. Welcome to your state Capitol. And this group of youth, they're youth advocates from the Juvenile Law Center in Philadelphia. And the project that they're engaged in is called Youth Fostering Change. It's an advocacy program for youth who are currently or formally involved in the child welfare system. Today, we had a hearing with Chairwoman Boback of the Children and Youth Committee, and we had incredibly moving testimony. A lot of it was very distressing about what we need to be doing in Pennsylvania and what we can do better. And it's very appropriate that today we are celebrating and raising awareness for foster care awareness. So behind us, as our guests, are, we have the current youth advocates. If you could raise your hand, we have Anthony Simpson, Anthony, we have Alexis Andino, Lakima Jones, Jonathan Hamilton, and with them from the Juvenile Law Center is Marcia Hopkins and Katie Otto. We also have with us um, stakeholders and individuals that are very invested in changing the foster care system. They're up in the gallery. We have Terry Henning with the PA Council for Children, Youth, and Families. If you could give a wave. Gary Krentz was here with the Resource Family Association. Sarah Wash with the Field Center. Rick Azero with Diacon and Swan. Jenny Pokempner from the Juvenile Law Center, Rachel Miller with PA Partnerships for Children, and Don Holden Woods from Turning Points for Children in Philadelphia. Right now in Pennsylvania, we have 2,000, we have 25,441 children that are in foster care. We have, they have about an average time of 13 months where they are in the system on average, but many languish in the system for years and years, never achieving permanency. We have an estimated 8,000 transition youth, transition, transition aged youth, and it's estimated that there are 392 youth in Pennsylvania right now who are um, getting training or college education. Only 392 of our foster youth.